Hello traders, my name is Julian Allen from First Prudential Markets. This video will introduce those watching to the ASX Centerpoint trading venue and also the functionality on trading this through the FP Markets platform. Currently on the screen is a web page where you can find out more information on the ASX Centerpoint trading venue. Please note the URL uh, and visit this after the video. Let's start with what ASX Centerpoint is. This is another liquidity pool or venue where trading can occur. ASX Centerpoint or CP venue exists between the best bid and ask on the ASX market. It is a dark venue, i.e. no participant can observe the depth or volume and whether or not that is a buy or a sell. It was introduced to increase the overall efficiency of the market while lowering execution costs. You may sometimes notice orders going through that have a smaller increment than what's showing on the platform. And these orders will be occurring in between the current bid and ask. The chances are these are center point orders. At the moment, we're looking at Telstra. And to see an example, you can see that we're seeing these orders go through between 55 and 56 at 55 and a half. If we go further and look at the course of sales, we'll be able to identify these orders. As you can see, they have the code CX or center point. So these are center point orders. So the question is now, how can this help you? Let's say that you are trying to buy Telstra and you would like to get a better price than what's being offered in the market. Although this sounds crazy, as we just saw, this can be a reality. To do this, you just need to make your order, whether this is a buy or a sell, an end of day order. This will automatically sweep the center point liquidity that sits between the best bid and the ask to see if there is a better offer there for you. So let's have a look at how this can work. So what we're going to do is we're going to try and place a sell order in Telstra uh, because we want to go short. Now, in order to take advantage of the sweep functionality, I simply go to the advanced tab and I select end of day and then I go ahead and hit my sell order. Now, if there is liquidity in the center point, that will get filled at uh, the 0.5 um, area. So we can see there that we've been done for nine at the center point, and then the remaining 41 have been done at the other side. So this is a perfect example of price improvement. It's found volume in the market at the center point. It's executed that for us, and then it's done the remaining 41 at, at the market. The reason I did a sell there was just to reiterate that this will work for both buys and sells. This means you can get price improvement on both legs of your trade. I'm guessing for all those frequent traders out there that that light bulb moment has just happened. And you have figured that this could equate to some massive savings when doing a lot of trading. There is more. We can also leave orders in the center point liquidity. That is, we can place an order just in the center point, and if there is volume on the other side, this will trade. Now let's have a look at how we would place an order just in the center point. So like any other order, we're short, so we go create buy. We want to try and buy back the 50. To access the liquidity, we come to end of day, and now what we do is we go CP limit. This will, this will mean we have to put in the price here because we're unable to toggle through the normal increments. We then simply hit buy and then go OK. And then we can see whether or not we get filled. And we can see there because it, it didn't stay in our pending order book, it went through and we've actually closed out that trade I hope that as traders you see the opportunities that this can uh, create for you. A few things to keep in mind. It is a different trading venue to the lit ASX. This means that you cannot amend CP limit orders to 
limit orders, you can only amend these to other CP limit orders. In order to amend to a limit order, you would have to firstly delete your CP limit order and then create a new limit order. The center point venue only allows orders to remain for the day and is not available during the match. This means that if you're keen to get into a stock on the open, you will have the same opportunity as everyone else when you are using center point liquidity. It also gives you another liquidity venue if you are wanting to enter or exit a position. Finally, it can also create scalping opportunities. These will be better suited to stocks that trade in the lowest price step increments. If you have any further questions, don't hesitate to contact us on 1300 376 233 for more information. Happy trading.